by going into the factory and revealing all of our secrets. Okay, well, good morning, everybody. And I'm back onto the server, and I guess that I have to do a little bit more explaining than I did last video. Last video, I've had a lot of people asking, or I had someone ask on, you know, uh, what I think so they were asking was, could they see more of the server? And so, yeah, my house is done. Here, here's our nation's flag. Okay, this this is what happens when you are in a, <laughs> when you're in a server with little kids. And you're also wearing a German World War II. Oh, wait, you, you can't see it. German World War II uniform. That's your skin. But anyway, I guess all that what I should do is introduce a little bit more of the server. So I'm going to go over to other uh, nations, and I'm going to show them off. Hopefully there's people over there. I don't know. I don't really talk to the people. I don't know, I, I just don't talk. So right here, here is the map. This is on the Stonks server, so you can... It, it's The link to this is in a Discord. So I guess so that the first one we're going to show off is... We're going to do KFC after. Remember in the last video, I said uh, Echo was doing a thing? Well, he has like a now little nation, so let's go visit him. I don't think so he's on server, though. But we're going to see, wait, is he in server? No, Echo's not in server, but we're going to go visit it anyway. So I will see you guys when we get there. Also, he has no other way, but you can see it up there, actually. You can. Now I just got to go and dodge skeletons, okay? I swear, it's a debate whether or not skeletons are worse or better. Oh, Jesus, never mind, never mind. We're going to wait till the morning. So yeah, a lot's been happening um, on the server. We've been trying to boost our farming production because farming at one point was actually really, really uh, good pay. So um, we have this farm, this house, I think so that we haven't gone, but uh, someone else is over here. We have um, who I call my online son lives here. His name is Ghost. I built him this house, and so far he loves it. Uh, I'll show the rest over there. We have this other random guy's house. I don't know who it is. If it turns out to be good, I might let him keep it. Because <laughs> it's a small house. Over here we have our enchantment area. With a little map. A little restricted only. Only I can go in there. Yet I've been told not to go in there, so it's kind of sad. Over here. I don't know if that's Poland flag. Someone comment down whether or not this is the Polish flag. Or if this is some other country's flag. I'm not depicting but actually, I, I shouldn't go inside the house. But here is a pro gamer's house. Really cool house. Not gonna lie. It, it really cool. I mean, the architecture on the outside is good. Inside, I've been on the inside. A little cramped. Here's our automatic uh, lava generator. Nice for fuel, I guess. But we haven't been using that. Uh, villager house, villager house. Here is what pro uh, MMA be. Last video, remember how I told you guys the house I did before? Yeah, this is MMAB. He is a full-blown American. <laughs> if, if this is how Americans would dress their house, I feel like that Karens would have all around would have been jumping on him, saying this is not up to code. Plus, we have a dangling cow. So that that's fun. Here's our sheep farm that literally glitches you out whenever you go in there. More farms over here. This thing, I don't even know what this thing is going to be. I, I, I don't know. You have Death's house. You got a cat. You got two horses. Here's Death's place. He took down my mailbox that I gave him. Uh, we have jungle tree farms. Here is um, here is uh, Conobellans slash Pokemon's house. It has a good design, but yeah. Anyway, you have the jail. Jail. Now again, the jail, you can't break into this place. I don't even have an iron axe, but watch. Never mind, actually, I can't. <laughs> it's going to take too long, and you guys don't want to see me just breaking glass here. Anyway, uh, we have the factory. Now, of course, it has a dangling sheep, and usually I would take you into every single house, except for that this thing is restricted. 
there is no one in the server, unless they are in the Reaper core, allowed into this. We have had people try to sneak in, and uh, that is causing a little bit of tensions, but we have our black sheep. Uh, the capital, our capital building, now very nice. Uh, we have our little meeting area. Here's a map of what we got. Over here is just a work in business. Uh, we got other houses. I'll show you guys these houses really quick, and then we're going to go on to other uh, factions. If it actually get, becomes day, I, I really wish that it was daytime. But yeah, out of all the buildings, I have built only like a small percentage, like maybe half the buildings here. So uh, I built this one. This one's now Gaff Pros' house. He extended it, and I kind of like the extension. Uh, this is Cody's house. He built this one by himself. Then we have uh, Billy's house, and Billy's house I made. You might recognize the design. It's from one of Mojang's houses. Uh, just put on like a little spindle of my own. Oh, there's our ideas on. Then we go over here. We have uh, Fax. Fax is also known as Interior, Interior Auditors. I don't know why do we have that. Uh, over here, just to explain that tower, I didn't make it. It was actually another faction that was coming over and they made it. We felt a little nervous having a tower that was made by someone else. And we thought that they were trying to make an outpost right there to check on us. But yeah. But so far, we can now go on to... Uh, his house, there's a skeleton right over there. <laughs> the mobs in here are really hard to kill. And I only have a sword. And actually armor, so I can put on armor. And Hopefully I don't die. If I, if I die, it's okay. Or if the ar armor breaks, I don't care as much. But we're going to go up to this man's house now. It's just a little hard getting up here. Anyway, so here's his bed and breakfast. Or I guess so that he didn't... Th there were signs right here. Oh, right here. Echoes. Uh, see, Echoes Airbnb currently. In the future, this will be Colonel's Clubhouse. DM. Oh, so you have to DM this guy. And here's his, like, no place. It's actually... Ah, oh, I forgot. Nation members aren't allowed. He made his into a nation. So, yeah. there's Here's Echoes' place. It's a shack on top of a mountain. We don't really know why did he choose this. It wasn't. Oh, it must have been the spot that he was building, uh, mining out cobblestone. Anyway, let's go on to our next uh, place, which would be uh, KFC, Kentucky FC. <laughs> that's how they. Uh, that's how they say it, I guess. But uh, let's go over there now. So uh, Kentucky K FC, I think so. That is still part of our nation. It is uh, belonging to another person that's been on the channel. You might know him as Rixley. Uh, Rixley has joined, and he's doing okay being in charge of his own place. Although we kind of wanted him to have, I don't know, maybe just a tad bit more people in it than by himself. In the villagers but it's all right and now we're just gonna skip on to the part where I actually get there just gonna take a few snacks you know uh, traveling over there is not gonna be an easy task but yeah here is the Kentucky FC uh, town yeah you can see that's not a whole lot if any really I don't even see where he has a crafting table it's kind of weird I don't it looks like that he hasn't even spent a lot of time in here this must be where his house is because it actually has a chest full of shovels uh, we can pay him back we, we can pay him back for the journey but yeah, nothing really exciting on the Kentucky FC. Um, but yeah, 
it, it, it's a place that, you know, the Reaper Core has spread out to. So let's go on and get to our next place, shall we? So zooming out, we have that one. Just another outpost uh, of them. We've been here. Here's another K uh, KFC outpost. It's just another village, really. Uh, if we expand out... Oh, there's actually a few more. We have Heaven. Oh, uh, we can go over to Heaven, I guess. We'll go see the, We'll go see God, okay? We'll go see God right now, but I, I don't know, because God sometimes is in a really cranky mood. But we'll go see. Okay, well, we're really close to it. Uh, there is, like, a bunch of rocks. Like, is it kind of shocking to see? Look at this. This is natural beauty. Hey! Almost ran into a few zombies there. <laughs> this is why you, there should be no distracted driving. There it is. Oh wow, they, they've heaven has really expanded onto their uh, land. Actually, is there any place you can really go to get up? There's a lot of stone, but I don't see a way to get up. Things so they even destroy the bridge over there, so I guess so. They're kind of like landlocked. I wish that I could show you guys. Like, I don't know how to get up there. Things so they've done it now to where you can only TP up yourself up there. You can see a little bit of remnants of what was up there. I don't really have building. Well, I do have building blocks, but those are not... I'm not going to be using those. So I'm just going to quickly get into here, and we're going to find our next spot so if we bring it back over we okay so that was heaven so the next spot is the holy encampment so we're gonna go over that direction so we'll see if we can find a river over there like I really wish so that everything could be connected by river I also just kind of realized there was a nation called the Jedi uh, Empire. It used to be a thing around here. And, um, I guess that when the server first started, a lot of the people didn't like the fact that this Jedi Empire was kind of like just ruining the game for people. They would kill people and uh, take all their stuff and it became an empire. So I guess that I guess a few people should be happy about the dismantle of it. There's also been a few other dismantles, like of the uh, heaven. There's been a few members from there that have been um that uh have had uh members succeed from there. I think so. A few members from the Jedi Empire have also came to us, so. Yeah, so they have a really big uh, farm, cow farm, a little bit of wheat farm, shit. I don't think so. That we can, yeah, we can't go in there. I'm gonna look in there. He has a block of iron. Also a cave. Okay, he has a cave. Uh, he has a potato farm. Oh, I couldn't get down there. Okay, I thought that was thought that was an option. <laughs> A uh, lot of potatoes. He has lots of potatoes. Lots of uh, cocoa beans, too. And sugar cane. Like, this man, sugar cane farm is insane. Kind of want to see what's in the end. What's in his end portal? Oh, his end portal is in the nether fortress? Neat. Neat. Okay, well, I'm going to go back in. Okay, well, there's that faction. Looks like that's only a single man operation, too. Kind of like the KFC. So, next place. Next place is spawn. So, we're going to head over to the actual spawn place, the place where you actually get to... Uh, Enjoy in there. Then it looks like that we'll be going over to um, Dari, uh, the Spartan Empire, and then ending it off. There's no others, right? Oh, there is one other. You have Nigeria, the Elisa, 
Eisen, like, there, there, there's so many. But yeah, let's go over to Spawn really quick. Hey, here's PT in the edit, and um, I know I said that would be over there, but I kind of died a few times getting over to those areas. So I decided that I was just going to do a map tour of these areas just because it was getting really hard for me to get to the places and show it off to you, but the map will show you a bird's eye view of the places. Again, sorry, I know I promised you guys an in-person kind of detail, but... I didn't want this video extending out for so long. So I will see you on the map tour. Bye. So actually, I'm actually going to just show uh, the places, actually, since I know that I can zoom up. Like, look at how close I can zoom up. I need to actually refresh or else it's going to be very laggy. Here's our place. Yay. I need to get a close-up of spawn. So getting a close-up of spawn. Here's where spawn is. Okay, so spawn... It's next to a ton of, uh, looks like there's a few iron or lava laces, but they're spawned. This is where everybody spawns at. Thought it was somewhere else. Oh, yeah, here it is. Here is where you guys spawn at. A nice little place, and it's outlined, as you can kind of see through here. It's outlined by a, a bedrock. And the bedrock is supposed to be a place where, you know, like you can. Possibly save yourself. You have a village. It looks like someone else has a house right over here. Then you have Dari. And Dari is right next to a village. But you can see that Dari is just farmland. Which, I, I, for me personally, I feel like that he's undermining the fact that he's trying to trade with villagers here. And it's not in a territory. It's not in his territory. So that means that he can't control it. Also, he has a witch. His hut. Probably took care of that. Come on, I just need you to... This is like the other thing that's like, uh, like killing, killing me right now. Um, so yeah, that was a few marshlands. Let's go look at the uh, Spartan Empire. Spartan Empire is the uh, other empire that I said earlier that had uh, very powerful players. Right now, their top player is ranked as King. And just to let you know, King is, like, so far the highest rank that you can get on right now. But there is, you know, like, other... There's more ranks. Right now, I think so they're, like, halfway through, maybe a little bit past halfway through all the ranks. Uh, so right here, you can see farms. It looks like a farm, like a villager's farm, villager's farm, a custom farm, custom farm. Looks like that they got a little trading center over here. Actually, no, this is their training center. I've been over here before. Training center. It looks like that this is, like, a... I don't know if that's a fountain or what, but they have like a copper. You can kind of see the like copper right here. They have some copper right there. More farms, more villager stuff. I don't know what this place is. I don't know what that is, actually. I wonder what these white blocks are, too. Or is that snow? Like, no, they're not even near a snow biome. This is their mob spawner. Again, I've been there, so I can tell. Okay. So we need it to load. So again, that Spartan Empire. They're, they're pretty far away from us, but we are allied with them. So it just kind of releases off a little bit of stress. Another bad thing with this map is that you have to constantly reload it, or else it will... Trying to get it all... Look at that, it's slowly... So over here, another funny thing is, you can spy on people. Look at that. So you got Baron, Richman, uh, Master. So he's a Baron. That's the rank Baron. So that's Richman. No, no, let me think. And Frozen Zero looks like that they are working on a mob farm. Yes, you can stock players in this game. Which is, <laughs> which is kind of great. Because you can have this open in a tab and you can just look and see if someone's actually coming over. Over here looks like that, ooh, ooh, it looks like that a tree is like partially out. Also, so is a, a little bit of a house right here. So that's kind of interesting to know that uh, there is, they also have a village nearby. 
But villagers aren't that powerful in the beginning. Let me see, what else? We have others down here. We have Einstein. What is that? Einstadtsgruppen? I don't know what that means in German. That's definitely German. Because that's a... I forgot that what that is. It looks like that's just like a lonely hut, though. A lonely hut. So it's maybe just like a lonely guy who got rank of settler. Now here is, I guess, is that a rival? It's kind of weird that it's a rival. Because this right here is a magnificent building. And I have no hate for it. Here's an automatic chicken farm. Here's the actual building. A mob farm right here. <laughs> Looks like that. He has his own farm. But it's a beautiful place. I don't know why we're really at it. I think it's the reason why we don't like this, this guy right here. It's just because <laughs> he, he said that we were mid. Again, right? Like I told you guys, teenagers or teenagers were here. Oh, this little guy. Who's this one? So the Mon Mongolian Antican looks like a little fortress with a farm <laughs> in a house. Nice. A, a cute little place. It's kind of shocking to see. Oh, wait, wait. There's something over here. And he's made a smiley face. Look at that. He got that little smiley face. We're going to zoom in bigger on that. Smiley face. Then it looks like that we have this guy. It looks like that he has a farm out there, so neat. Also, all this dark spots right here, this is land that has never been discovered. So everything that's been like shown is something that either I have gone to or other players in the server has gone to. Uh, if we go over here, looks like that this is Nigeria. Nigeria, lots of farms, looks like. A lot of squared off properties. I'm really interested to see it on what this is. This looks like a huge farm of some kind. But you got Nigeria. And then there was a player over here who had a really fun name, and I want to see the name. This name. This name. I do not want this guy to rank up at all. Because who else but this guy has such a badass name to be called Lord Farthole? One, two, three, four. Oh, what's that? That's actually like a pretty cool place, it looks like. And I really want to go over there and check it out. But of course, everyone's like so secretive. So, <laughs> so he's probably not going to want me to actually go over there. Oh, let me see. Is there anything else? Let me see. Any Anything else? Like, I'm just going to check the map. Look at where people have been. No. Checking. And someone's been going on. Oh, wait a minute. We do have one. Monkey Town. Monkey Town is actually in the Reaper Core, it looks like. Because uh, I mean, you have this black outline, that means that they're allies. Or not allies. It's actually owned by us. So Monkey Town is apparently owned by us, and it has one huge farm. That is really kind of shocking to see that our <laughs> that the Reaper Core has expanded out that far. Let me see. Is there any other places? No, actually. I guess it is not. So let's go back down here. You have to kind of, like, follow the path. <laughs> the, the guy's path is just incredible. Now we're up here to... Yeah, I guess so. Well, I guess so that is the whole server. Uh, I guess the other stuff that I will show you guys in here is the ranks. So remember how I was mentioning ranks, just like Lord, a uh, Baron... So if you do slash ranks, here's a rank. So you start off not even as a wilding. You started with no ranks. Then you get wilding, which rank you begin as. You have very little privileges and will need to start getting money to get up in life. Privileges. The ability to join a job. The ability to use MCM. The ability to leave spawn. Then you got a nomad. Nomad travels the land in search for a better life. 
privileges, he gets one set home. Then he got Seraph. Now that you've worked your way up, you can finally join the town and work together with other people. So you can join a town when you're a surf. Villager. Time to settle in. Villages, you get two more set homes. Now you got an artisan. It's time to make a living for yourself through an honest trade. So... Again, these all cost money. Privileges, you get to do recipe and the ability to craft iron tools. Settler. A settler is able to create his own town and invite people to join him. Privileges, slash town new, and you get three more set homes. Warrior. Time to fight. Rarg. <laughs> Rarg. <laughs> anyway, privileges, you can do slash craft and the ability to craft iron armor. Night. Uh, what the? We're not going to show that word, okay? We're not going to show that word. I'm going to have that word blocked by something. I don't know what it's going to be. I'm going to block that. Uh, privileges. Ability to craft diamond tools, okay? Then you have master. You have become a highly respected member of society. When you become a master. Privileges, you get four set homes. Hmm, interesting. Then you have Lord. You can now create a nation and bring many towns together. Become a Lord and rule over your fee... What the... Huh? So this one you can create a new nation. Baron. Uh, you just get an end chest. Count. Uh, you get another set home. Uh, this one... I, uh, nothing really. You just get the ability to trade with villagers. Duke, the ability to craft diamond armor. So right here, knight, you can craft diamond tools, but you can't do, you can't have diamond armor until then you're a duke. Prince, you get another set home, so you get six total homes. So basically the higher rank you got, the more homes you can have, I guess. So privileges, the ability to silk touch spawners. Archduke. Uh, here's King. Now remember, this is as far as they got, as the server has gotten, is to King. Which is five million dollars. You have to pay five million dollars. Uh, the ability to craft Eyes of Ender. The ability to activate end portals. Emperor is when you can have more homes. Then you have Priest. Which can slash feed yourself slash feed others. That, that's going to put farmers out of business at the time. A saint. You can be a saint in this thing, too. Oh, wait. Saints can control the weather, so this is the god one. <laughs> you could be god, and, and you're actually being called a saint. A legend. You can have eight homes. Immortal. Get extra row of hearts. Angel. You can have another house. Angels have more houses than anybody. Uh, celestial. Ooh, you can... With your... You can change the mobs that come out of spawners. Ooh, that would actually be a really good one because then we can get some pretty good one. Uh, uh dead, Deddy? What is that? Uh, anyway, you get another uh, house, I guess. Divine. A personal P vault for storage. Okay, so you get your own personal vault. And the last one, God. You can become God. Remember, I said you can become God. And you can do slash fly. Right now, everyone's here. I would love to be right here. But uh, anyway. Uh, there is stocks. Uh, I don't know how to operate stocks, okay? This is why I don't want to be in college for, you know, any kind of, like, economics. Economics, no. Building, yes. But uh, over here, see that, that Tanjorio? He's my son. I don't care what the rest of this nation says. This man is my son and I refer to him as Ghost. He is my son. If you're gonna ask me on who my wife is, I will reveal it in a different video. I'll, I'll reveal who my, who my wife is that I had that child with right over there. If this thing gets to 10 
likes, or not 10 likes, actually 100 likes. 100 likes on any video, and I will reveal on who this guy's mother is and who's my wife. Otherwise, it, it's not. Rich man, join the game, oh no. Rich, rich man's pretty rich. <laughs> He's richy rich. But yeah, you know what, I wanna end this by going into the factory and revealing all of our secrets! Kidding! Just kidding, I'm only showing the office. Ha ha, suckers, you guys thought that you would actually be able to see what's inside of here. No, you know what I'm actually gonna show? What's actually in here? The dangling sheep and me falling off, bye. I'm just kidding. But yeah, make sure that you guys like and subscribe to the video and I will see you guys in another video. Uh, if something happens on here, like a planned war or something, I might film that or if there's just funny moments. I might compile that up into different videos, but for now, stay tuned. I'm going to try to do other videos like that, War Thunder and Stormworks. But right now, it's just I need a thought that I should do a proper introduction to the server. But I will see you guys later, okay? Bye!